look what we got over here, YouTube. FedEx just dropped me off some new goodies. We about to unbox these shits right here. Y'all see that? The JBL 305P MK2s. I don't know why they're calling them the MK2s because I think the speakers that was before these were the, was the LSR 305s. So, I don't know. I don't know the reason for the, the P, but whatever. Anyways, I, I just, I, I picked these up. Um, I recently sold my Mackie uh, MR6. But first of all, let me tell y'all something right now. This is an unboxing, but at the same time, I'm going to be giving y'all the background of why I bought these. And anytime I do any unboxings of any new music equipment I got, I got to tell a story behind it. You know, I just don't want to go straight to, you know, just the details of the, um, of the equipment that I get. Because, you know, I mean, this is shit that I'm personally buying. It's not shit that somebody's sending to me and I'm reviewing it and then sending the shit back. So, I'm going to tell a story about it if you... if you're not somebody that ain't come, you know, you're not really trying to hear all the background stories and all that shit, but, you know, maybe this probably ain't the video you want to go to, but if you, you know what I mean, if you don't mind hearing me ramble about some shit, then, you know what I mean, just chill out and, you know, sit back. Anyways, I saw, I just recently sold my Mackie MR6 MK, I mean, not MK, um, MR, um, 2s, uh, it's the second, um, generation, um, I don't know. I just sold them just to sell them. I buy a lot. I bought so much equipment over the years and just resell it. Like I get them from a website and I make payments on them and like it goes so fast before you know it, you own the shit. So it's like I get it, sell it, then go back on there and get some and put some more shit on some payments and shit like that. You know, I got it. I can I can buy out a lot of shit, but. You know, why do that? You know what I mean? Why spend four hundred dollars if they only want thirty dollars for you know what I mean for some months and you know what I mean? I, I ain't I'm not rich off this music shit yet, so say hell with it. Just give them a little thirty dollars, keep some money in my pocket, use it to go get some more shit. But I sold those on um eBay. And um I actually was gonna get the third generation of the Mackies, but the way that the payments was gonna come out, it was just too much at the time. I don't know what happened, but the website I get them from, they they changed their like their first down payment. I guess now they putting the taxes on top of it. I don't know. They doing some weird shit. It looked more than what it. It's like it cost more than what it was before. But I said, no, nah, I'm good. So I ended up going with these. Now before I had before um I had those Maggies, I also had the the um the JBL eights. The um, LSRs. I don't remember why I sold those. I wish I wouldn't have sold them. Because I actually love the design of these speakers. Like, I love the way the tweeter looks. But, you know what? Let me let me open this shit up and then show y'all what I'm talking about. Like I said, these are the... Let me pull these right here. These are the... um. The fives, which honestly I'm not a huge fan of five inch speakers, but um, cause I, I just hate how small they look. But these actually kind of had some height to them. They kind of look like the um. Let me focus this. Kind of um has the same height as like some um six inch monitors. And you know what? I also said that I wanted the um. I'm gonna just show one speaker. I'm not gonna show the other one. But actually, I wanted the. Uh, I ain't gonna lie to you. I wanted them KRKs. But I, I, I'm mad at the fact that they, they, they changed the um, prices on it. So that kind of. Oh shit. Let me uh, set this down real quick. Sorry about that, y'all. <clears throat> Feel free to fast forward or. I might, I don't know shit, I might, I might edit this shit out. Here go the speakers out the box. Oh, they look so beautiful. Now here's the thing about these speakers that I saw from somebody else reviewing. This um, casing 
they said is 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 is, is um it picks up a lot of fingerprints and shit. So if you get these, probably try not to even um touch that. All right, so I'm gonna uh, sit this down and I'm gonna take them out and put them on the desk. Well, I mean, you probably want to see me taking this shit out. Again, uh, I'm bad with these unboxings. So we got some, um, you know, your quick setup guide. Do anybody really be doing this right here? Like when they be showing you like placements and shit. I don't, <laughs> I don't know. I don't, I don't do all that shit. It never really works the way I want it to work. So. All right, you know something too, but I just realized when I sold my other speakers, I sold the cords with it. So I think I don't have any goddamn cords. Oh, here we go. This is a way better angle. So I'm gonna put that right there for y'all. Hold on. Let me take my screen out so I can look and see what's going on. Make sure I got this focus real good. All right. But a goddamn dead roach. No, I'm just kidding, y'all. I, <laughs> I ain't gonna lie to you though. Anytime I buy a box, that's the first thing I be worried about, like some kind of dead ass insect or something in this shit. That kind of shit freak me out and shit. Cause you know these shit be sick sitting in, in um warehouses and shit. You don't know what kind of shit in there. Get you some speakers and they sent you a complimentary on um, dead rat and shit in the speakers. <laughs> oh, let's, get, let's, let's open this up. So this is different. They um they take the power cords to the speakers, which I don't understand. Make it more shit difficult than it has to be. So I'm just doing an unboxing. Uh, you might see later videos of me playing the speakers. I ain't really too much concerned about that. I just wanted to hurry up and do this unboxing before I um, before I got to use them because I'm ready to make some make some beats. Two days without making beats is like it, 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 it just drives it drives me crazy. Um, trying to make sure I don't touch the. Um, I love that smell, that brand new smell. Let me grab the camera, bring it up closer. Now, as you can see with this plastic, I've never seen that before on the speaker, so I can tell you right now that. Yeah, this little shit right here is going to get a lot of fingerprints on it, but I'm not even going to touch it. Oh, my goodness. Don't they look so sexy? Ah, oh, shit. Let me see if I can get some better light over here. There we go. Look at that. So shiny. They look... Oh, my goodness, man. They look so professional and the thing that tripped me out is about the price these are for 109 109 dollars it's got them bluetooth speakers at that price and this is coming from a company this ain't no you know what i mean this ain't no weak ass company like this is a professional company and shit man i don't know why they do that they did that too with the um with the 
the monitors that they had before these, the LSR, they did the same thing, marked them down like that. So I don't know if a lot of these companies, I think a lot of these companies were trying to beat out um, KRK. So I think that's why they be doing those prices and shit. But yeah, you got me. You sold me on them and shit. Um, so like I said, these are the five inch monitors. Let y'all see the back of it. Shit, man. I gotta get some better lighting in here. I don't wanna mess them up before I use them. All right, so you got your inputs. Um, I'm not even sure what that is, but it says input, input um, sensitivity. Yeah, I don't know what that is. You know, you got your room controls and shit. Got your volume knob, your off button, and your, um, you know, you put your power record and shit. Uh, you got the back base port, which I'm not. Another thing I'm not a fan of, but like I said, I'm not gonna complain too much about the price. And for some of y'all don't know, you usually don't wanna get this. That just means you gotta keep them at a further distance from the walls. And this, for, this is for newbies. This ain't for nobody who already know this shit. If you already know this shit, then just ignore this shit. But like, you, you really wanna get ports that are like in the front of it. For the base ports that way you ain't got to worry about how close it is to the wall and shit but um let me see i'm gonna just read off a couple things off of the box i mean i'll let y'all oh man my lighting is poor so it say professional balance input selectable input sensitivity um it says so i guess that's for capabilities with a wide range of consumer professional signal sources yeah whatever um got your uh high filter trim volume control boundary eq uh, high frequency transducers low frequency yeah blah 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 um it says bigger power big sound um oh okay well that's something different 82 is that trying to think that might be a little bit more power i think it's 82 watts it's a class d um amp provides abundant output hey y'all can um you know pause and read this um read this shit uh, oh shit there's a whole bunch of shit over here too oh look i ain't finna read all that shit you can go on the website and uh hear that shit So my bad, I was reading something. I, I see this right here. I didn't know this was like something that you can add on to. I'm like, shit, what's that? But I don't know. I look like some speakers and sh shit. As you can buy like that. But yeah, this is a speaker, man, right here, you know. Um, like I said, besides the price, I also bought it because of, like I said, the, the um, put this back over here. So I could bring this as far as this light gonna go. But I bought it because of that speaker right there. I like the fact that they said that you can listen to it no matter like what what um angles and shit you at. So you know. But like I said, I, I like JBL and I ain't even really listen to these, but I, I just it's just certain companies I trust that they're gonna put out quality speakers. So I just went ahead and took the chance. But like I said, I wanted the rockets. And also, you know what I forgot? I got these because I, I do have intent to get a second pair of speakers, but it may not even be, it may be like some old speakers from like some um, eight inch models from like Behringer. Behringer has pretty good shit too. And it's, it's on it's really on the cheap side, but I, I know if that shit ever breaks, I heard you gotta ship it out to Germany and shit. And that can be a, um, a hassle and shit. But anyways, like I said, man, these are, these are JBLs, man, I can't wait to make some some beats on here and shit these actually look bigger than they looked in the store so sometimes the speakers might look little but they be big once you get them in front of you and then some five inch monitor speakers from certain companies is just 
bigger. Like I knew these was bigger than the M Audio. Like I said, these kind of look like the same size as my six inch monitors and shit, but you know what I mean? I decided to, you know, change my, um, I just switched out my studio desk and shit. I, I, um, I had a regular, um, studio desk. Um, I forgot what it's called. It's, um, it's like the standard one that you probably see in Guitar Center, but I just wanted everything, like, leveled, like, right in front of me and shit. And I, I hate speaker stands and all that shit, so I decided I should save my stands for my, um, 8 inch monitors and shit, but I know a lot of shit I'm talking about right now is just blah 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 blah, but yeah, um, yeah, so uh, I just lost my uh, train of thought and shit. Uh, <laughs> uh, yeah, but these are the JBLs, you know what I mean? If you ain't subscribed to my channel, man, subscribe to my channel, man. I, I got the beats. Um, I'm gonna be doing more videos like this. Just giving out advice and shit like this, you know what I mean? Just to make my channel a little bit more interesting. But if you know what I mean, if you, if you got time, go listen to my beats. Comment, you know what I mean? Let me know what you think. Uh, this is Black Universe. I'm out. Peace.